Hi guys, this is Super Boo 3 and today we're continuing our playthrough of Valkyrie Chronicles. This time we are in Chapter 1 and this is the second mission in the game, Defense of Brawl. I'll explain the mission. Okay, let's find out what this mission is before we get started. Now remember if you saw how I did the first mission, we have to try and beat the mission in as few turns as possible. Um, I'm not a veteran of this game and I'm going to show you the way I'm going to get the A ranks which is probably going to be the easiest way I can possibly find um, okay so we basically need to get things done in one turn most of the time so we need to find this enemy leader and okay, defeat him now he's obviously not going to be at the front so we need to get as far through the enemy lines as we possibly can Our target is the now Welkin has more health than Alicia, so I'm going to use him as my front man to see where everyone is. So let's do that, so Welkin, let's go, and we've got to make sure we at least kill one person here. I'm just going to run straight through the middle. The lines of sights are risky, but the enemy aim is pretty atrocious. So we actually will be fine. Now anyway, we're going to run all the way through here. Now it mentions that if we press L1 and R we can flick, quickly flick between the enemies. And we're going to go for headshots because they always do more damage. So there that's him taken down. Now Welkin's on half health which isn't great but we regenerate health between turns. So just make sure you end your turn as quickly as possible so he doesn't die. Now Alicia's going to take another shot at these guys. And the thing is, I, we want to maximise the number of troops we actually take out while we're doing things. Because... Enemy sighted. That also um, will make our characters level up more. So we're going to shoot this guy on the right. Headshot, taken out, not a problem. Hmm. Now we can actually change our weapons to a secondary weapon. Now we need to take out this guy here to the left who looks suspiciously like the captain to me. So let's switch to our grenade. Now we want that there. Can you see how it's turned red? We want to throw it at this guy. And that should take him out because he got behind him and there we've taken out the captain one turn we took out multiple guys there was no risk using that method of actually taking any damage um, oh, it looks like we've got a small cutscene and the mission isn't actually quite over yet it looks like there's going to be a second part to this one and I don't know what's coming but I think it's going to be dangerous yep it's a tank wonderful it, we haven't got a method of taking this out. Um, we're going to just have to run for our lives. Oh, by the way, in that first part, if you're having difficulty, you can always just um, use all your turns to shoot at the captain if you're struggling with the grenade but the way I showed you is the best way to do it okay let's see what we've got to do this time all oh, right it's the computer's turn have you noticed our health is back to maximum again so we don't really have to stress about trying to run out of here it looks like they've moved our positions as well I just noticed That'd have been horrible if Malkin got shot there. Yeah, we've done 15 damage total on that tank, so we wouldn't be able to take that out in 20 turns even if we tried. Um, that glowing blue radiator on the back looks like a Welcome big giveaway for damage, though. That's not good. We're not equipped to take out a tank. I hate to say it. Get off this road and into the alley to the east. It's and try to stay behind cover while moving. What? 
a Welkin only needs to reach the destination. Which means, as we've got three CP points, there's no reason for me not to use Alicia to at least take out one of these guys to minimise how much damage he can take. Because I want to maximise how much we level as well. Personally, here. Yeah. And let's end her action. Now let's try and plan out a route. Now as Welkin, we can try and run behind the tank. Which I think would get us killed. So we're not going to do that. We're going to run in front of the tank. Which is completely suicidal and dangerous. But if we run along this side... Yeah, we seem to be fine. And then let's just go to the stick to the right. And I think we've made it to the back alley. There we go, yeah. So that wasn't too difficult to get the A rank on either. That should be an A rank at least, because I can't see how I could have finished that any quicker. Like we shook him. So what are you doing from here? If they're rolling in the tanks, there's not much the town watch can do. We'll try to buy time so everyone can get away. I'll dig in my heels at the main gate and do what I can to stall them. Poor Alicia, I feel sorry for her. Let's just ask okay. him to die. I'll head back to my house and grab Isara and Martha, then come back. Be careful out there, Welkin. And that looks good. We managed to get a few kills there. So, guys, that was another A rank. Thanks for watching. Until next time, Escape from bye. Rule.